Hey folks, today I'm sitting down with Academy Award winning director Steven Pittsburgh to talk about his new film, The Blind Stenographer. Mr. Pittsburgh, thank you so much for meeting with us today. It is truly an honor. Oh, it's no trouble at all. Well, you've had such a storied career with amazing masterpieces like Cry Hard, Blue River Blues, and of course, Eat, Pray, Die. I mean, your eye for storytelling is truly unmatched. <laughs> so what do you think about the MCU? I'm sorry, what? You know, the uh, MCU. Biggest movie franchise of all time, millions of fans worldwide. Got any uh, thoughts on it? Think the movies are a little repetitive? The characters are bland? That they haven't made a good creative decision since Infinity War? Oh, okay, I see what's going on here. You're trying to get me to say something vaguely negative about the MCU so you can turn it into an attention-grabbing headline and have it trend on Twitter, bringing millions of clicks to your little website. <laughs> nice try, but let's just stick to talking about my movie, shall we? Ah, uh, you got me, but you know, I had to try. Anywho, in your new movie, the protagonist goes on a long and arduous journey of self-discovery and atonement. How would you say that compares to, I don't know, Tony Stark's journey in the Iron Man films? Well, to be honest, I haven't seen those films, so I can't really compare their journeys. Oh, so you're saying those films aren't worth your time? Uh, no, no, uh, I've just been very busy with projects. It's, it's hard to keep up on everything, you know, when you're on set. <clears throat> yeah, okay. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. So your protagonist, the titular blind stenographer, is played by the incomparable and wonderfully talented Tom Hiddleston. What was it like working with him? Oh, Tom was amazing. Just the most giving actor. Super professional. I really think he turned in the performance of his career in this film. Oh, so you're saying that every other performance of his has been complete crap. Like his 11 years playing Loki? You know, people were devastated when he died during Infinity War. Devastated! Oh, <laughs> no, no, no. I Obviously, I think that he is great in all of the roles that he plays. I mean, uh, <clears throat> his tenure as Loki was unmatched. I just meant to say uh, that I think that he did a really good job in this movie, and in my excitement, my answer came out a little more uh, hyperbolic than intended. Mm-hmm. Sure. Look, can we please just not talk about anything MCU-related? I beg of you. I'm only here to talk about my movie and no one else's. You know what? Here, you're loud and clear. And on my honor as a blogger slash journalist slash activist, I promise not to ask any more questions about the MCU. <sighs> Thank you. So do you think Brie Larson should smile more? Wow. Okay. Nope. That's it. I'm not playing your stupid little game. You people are so desperate for clicks that you're willing to sink to any level to get your precious little soundbite. You're no better than paparazzi chasing that one mistake, that one nip slip, that one fat pick to exploit for your own monetary gain. You know, I'd call it gotcha journalism, but that would be an insult to journalism. You're not a news site. You're barely even an entertainment site. You're just a pointless miasma of buzzwords fighting for relevancy in the final death throes of a dying medium. And you put those dumb red circles and arrows in your thumbnails, and they don't even point to anything. You don't really care about me or my work. You're just trying to get me to say something like, oh, the MCU sucks. Breaking news from Film Sweat, famed director Steven Pittsburgh said in a recent interview that the MCU sucks? Or even, oh, these copy and paste movies are ruining the industry for small and mid-tier films. BuzzBlog News has gotten word that once beloved director Steven Pittsburgh said Marvel movies are, quote, ruining films. Or, here's a classic, that the MCU movies are little more than amusement park rides. Disgrace and sexist probably film director Steven Pittsburgh joins clueless director Martin Scorsese in stating that Marvel movies are nothing but theme park rides. Pooh. Well, if that's what you're looking for, then you can just give up right now because you're not getting anything from me. Actually, I got everything I needed. What? Yeah, we're done here. Thank you so much for your time. That's a wrap. Let's pack it up, boys. Wait. What happened? Did I win? Oh, fuck. Fame director Steven Spiel in Pittsburgh. <laughs> Steven Pittsburgh. Steven Sp Steven Pittsburgh. Steven Pittsburgh. Damn it, I actually had it that time. Steven Pitts. Damn it. Steven Sp <laughs> We got it, right? We already have it? No, we what do you mean we don't have it? We barely have it. No. We have like two great takes.